Hey guys, hello everyone and welcome to the channel. So we are in the mid of April and we are supposed to have a CSI net exam in two months that is in the mid of June 2024, right? And uh, we don't have much time. We just have two months for the exam and there is no notification. There is no information. There is no tweet regarding the exam. So whether this year CSI net exam is going to get delayed, okay? Or whether we are going to see a delay in the exam uh, because of a very major factor which is Lok Sabha elections this year. We are having a general election this year which is around similar time but is the election going to affect the CSI net exam whether the exam is going to get delayed or not. We are going to talk about all that in detail in this particular video. It's all about my opinion based upon the previous track record of CSI net and based upon the previous history of the exam. Okay so we are going to discuss all those things. Do let me know in the comment section what are your thoughts about it okay because this is like a like it's kind of a opinion from my side so you can also share your opinion all right so starting with a very important update which might be useful to understand CSI net exam is that uh, UPSC uh, pre-exam for 2024 was scheduled in the month of in the last week of May and because of the general elections it is postponed to 16th of June okay now 16th of June is an important day but why because generally we have a CSI net exam around that week itself because you if you are following this exam you might know this that we have this CSI net exam in the second week of June and in the second week of December that's how they conduct or that's how these are scheduled. So yeah UPSC exam is now scheduled already in that particular uh, like in that particular day. Now talking about that uh, whether this election is going to affect it or not okay so if you don't know about the timeline of the election so the phase uh, the polling phases are going to end by the end of the May in the last week of the May and in the first week of June uh, the results are going to be announced so everything can be wrapped up by the end of the first week of June all right uh, but now we have to look upon the previous data or the previous uh, history of CSI net which was held along with the elections which was last time uh, along with the general elections which last time held in the year 2019 okay so in 2019 the general elections were held uh, the, the polling was held from 19th of april to the mid of may and the results were announced before the may ends or in the last week of may and CSI net exam was conducted in the month of uh, June okay in the mid of June that was 16th of June 2019 so exam was conducted on time there was no delay in the exam because there was 15 days gap or more than 15 days gap between the election results and the uh, and the exam okay now the the thing is that why the election is going to affect uh, the result the reason is because you know most of the schools most of these places are are like they are conducted or they are converted into polling booth people, like government wants to people to go and vote so that uh, they don't conduct exams during that region so that people don't have some other work to do they they are like they go and they vote for that for, for the nation okay that's what the idea is so that's why like uh, these elections when they are conducted exams are postponed a little bit and that's why UPSC exam is postponed now coming and let's try to you know compare both the years 2019 and 2024. So in 2019 the exam was conducted by UGC and CSIR in the combined manner. It was used to be called joint CSIR UGC net exam. The authority or the conducting agency was UGC and CSIR both okay. So they used to conduct the exam and they just have to conduct two exams. Uh, one was CSI UGC net and the other one was UGC net exam. Okay. But now you know that from the past few years, NTA National Testing Agency has been appointed as the, as the agency or as the organization who is going to conduct the exams. Okay. So NTA has started conducting the CSI net exam from the past few years and NTA does not only conduct CSI net, they conduct others exam as well. Like they conduct uh, like IITJ exam like IITJ mains, IITJ advanced. They also conduct NEET uh, exam. They also conduct uh, like UGC net. They also conduct CSR net. So there are a lot of exams which this NT or national testing agency has to conduct. And because of these elections, 
they have to push all these exams in that buffer zone or in that particular month of june july okay so because of that this is what i expect that the exam could be delayed a little bit maybe not in the second week of june but maybe in the third or the last week of june that could be the you know tentative date of exam because there is no notification yet there is no information there is nothing about csr net till now on the platform on the twitter on their official website there is nothing about that anywhere so that is one idea okay the second thing is that uh, many of the like many of the people were peculiar about it that because the uh, elections were be, will be very close to the exams let's say if the elections are in the month of last week of may and if somebody is having exam in the first week of june then uh, like during polling or during when you go to the poll they, they put a ink on your fingers right just to mark that yes we have voted for the nation so is that mark going to affect for the exam so nta has released a public notice for that on their website which says that it has nothing to do with the exam so you go and vote and have that ink that is not going to bother you or that is not going to stop you from giving exam now because nta has given this information that means they are they are ready to conduct some exams just after the elections or just after the results so they might start conducting exams from the first week of june but still if they like if they try to conduct exams every weekend or every week in that way also csr net exam might get delayed a little bit but it won't be delayed a long you cannot expect it to delay by one month or two months okay it can be delayed around one week or two or two weeks but the idea of making this video is not to let you relax for that okay don't just watch this video and just just think that okay i have enough time to prepare and just go in a you know in a uh, non-serious zone for the exam no it should not be like that these are just my opinion they can be wrong and exam can be conducted on the on the tentative date or it can be conducted in the mid of june as expected so be prepared for that okay unless and until any official announcement is given or unless and until you see any tweet or something whenever it will come i will inform you of course on this particular channel but still you have to be prepared with the with your part with your preparation with your studies don't go in that relaxed zone okay don't go into that uh, condition that okay i'm relaxed now i have enough time to study nothing like that okay if let's say you get two weeks extra you have to prepare more or you have to study more or you have to utilize that time for your betterment all right so this was all about this particular video there is one more very important update which has been announced by ugc regarding the admission in the universities for phd uh, based upon the net score so i will be making a video upon that in detail on my another channel which is all about research youtube channel so you can go and watch that video over there one more important thing that if you are preparing for csi net exam and if you want to prepare physical chemistry and want to have my lectures want to like learn from my classes then my beta batch is running on our app which is all about chemistry app you can just download the app and you can purchase the batch i purchase the course and you can watch the classes classes are recorded over there and along with those classes you will also get mock tests so that you you just look upon that how much prepared you are for the exam and uh, that's all for this video so thank you so much for watching and all the best for your preparation do let me know what you guys think about this particular uh, exam whether it will be delayed or not according to you and that's all from my side see you guys in the next one till then have a great day bye bye take care